a priest who was in prison for five months during Argentina's military dictatorship, has issued a statement clearing Jorge Manuel Bergoglio, now Pope Francis, of playing a role in his arrest. Francisco Halix was addressing reports Bergoglio had passed along information about him and another Jesuit priest that led to their detention and torture. He now says, quote, I myself was once inclined to believe that we were the victims of a denunciation. But he said, quote, at the end of the 90s, after numerous conversations, it became clear to me that this suspicion was unfounded. It's therefore wrong to assert that our capture took place at the initiative of Father Bergoglio. Halek's statement appears to contradict what he originally told the Argentine journalist Horacio Verbitsky. He appeared on recently on Democracy Now! and said that Halix had confirmed a report by the second priest, Orlando Yorio, who has since died, that Bergoglio was involved in their imprisonment. He talked with him, and he confirmed the story, but he didn't want to be mentioned in my piece, because he told me that he preferred to not remember this sad part of his life and to pardon, and he was for oblivion and pardon. That he was, during a lot of years, very resented against Bergoglio, but that he had decided to to for, for, forgot and forget. To see our full interview with Horacio Verbitsky in Argentina, and read the transcript, you can go to our website at democracynow.org. Thanks so much for watching this report from Democracy Now!, your daily independent global news hour. We don't accept advertising or corporate funding, but rather rely on donations from viewers like you. Please make your contribution by visiting democracynow.org. We need your support today to keep bringing you this hard-hitting, in-depth reporting.